to my travel series where I'll be bringing you the latest on food, wine, travel and culture in Zanzibar. Move this place a bit higher in your priority list. This is Living It Up, Zanzibar. So earlier this year, I was fortunate enough to go for the Zanzibar Spice Tour, which is something that I had always wanted to do. And I wanted to do it a bit differently. I just wanted to get my hands dirty. I wanted to go to the farm and try the different spices, you know, like smell, touch and feel them. And I got to do that. And I'll be showing you what happened throughout the Spice Tour. We just met our guide for the Spice Tour, Rajab. Yes. Yeah. So his name is Rajabu and he's going to take us through the spice tour. So we're just going down on this uh, dirt road to the spice tour but on the sides I can see different plants. Let me just show you. Yeah. What is this farm called? Not this farm huh. is Zimbani Spice Farm and this Nat Nuri Spice okay so what is happening is we are looking for the nutmeg tree yeah. and rajab is just asking his friend whether he can show us some nutmeg trees so what happens is you have to request for someone you can't just come and take the fruits yourself so yeah we want to see the fruit that makes nutmeg so as you can see he's getting some fruits for us takes the ripe fruits and when they are overripe they fall down so what you want is to take a fruit that is yellow this is how the fruit looks like hmm I can actually smell it okay yes have you smelt it so, and also what do you think nutmeg itself oh, well, that is the nutmeg yeah. uh -huh. nutmeg itself mm. and these uh, Red things covered on top. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this you call a mess. Mess of a nut. There's a bit. There's a bit. Mm-hmm. Which one? Which one? Actually, which red? In a mess. Mess. Yeah. You take any other kitu? Am I not allowed to? No. He na niyet na itumi akatika kupikiya. Hmm. Katika fish. Oh. Yeah. So he's just telling us that um, the nutmeg powder can be used as Viagra or an aphrodisiac. So hmm. it leaves you with this aftertaste in your mouth, but it smells nice. Kunoka ya ina nokia, like in it is. But testing bar. Labda we eke kwa chai. No. What Mostly will one of our? Uh, so it's supposed to be put in soup. Following test and Rajab and our assistant right there. Ana itwa je? Una itwa? Jamal. Na Jamal. So we're just looking at a plant called anatrodai that was used as a natural lipstick. So when you crush the seeds, you get this red. So the red plants cannot be used. The red anatrodai cannot be used until it's only red. If it dries up, it just becomes black and it can't be used when it's black. So he had gone to fetch us a matured one. So you're supposed to crush the seeds yeah. and apply as lipstick. Ah, mm. in a car yeah. lipstick. Yeah. Do a swatch. Here is my swatch. <laughs> Indian women, they like to put mm. a dot on their face. Ah. And sometimes <laughs> Maasai. Wow, yeah. on their hair. hair. Wow. There you have it. If you don't have any lipstick, this you can use it as lipstick and it will look good. Ka? Kapok. Cup of tea. Yeah, Never heard of it. Tree. Have you ever heard of it? So, ah, see. this it looks like here. cotton candy. <laughs> so this is the cup of tree. 
that is very hollow inside and it's used to make boots. You see, so this is a tree. There is a lot of elliptical fruits, but all those are dried. Oh, so it could dry kabisa in a... And then I produce something like produce that. This. Yeah. Ni cassava? Yeah, ah, cassava. this is cassava, this is pumpkin, this at home. So we just got adorned with cassava necklaces, neck pieces. Amazing art. So we are just telling them that whoever who came up with this concept must be such a creative. How do you create a neck piece out of leaves? Tess, how is yours fitting? pepper mm -hmm. you have to pick this one green equal green yeah Equa green then you're allowed to dry on the sun okay. after dried changing okay. the color mm -hmm. from green to black one okay so uh breastfeeding mothers after giving birth yes. they use black pepper yeah. to increase the milk production i never knew that interesting you learn different things every day <laughs> Look at the fruit. Ah, cloves! Oh my, why didn't I get? <laughs> these are cloves. Yeah. <laughs> so these are the flowers. The leaves do not smell like the flower. They don't smell even anything. Yeah, the leaves, the leaves actually have a different smell. Or it smells differently when it's dried. Yeah. So indoor mm. clove. Yeah, elokauka. So this is the dry clove. Ah. In Zanzibar, they believe that you can't prepare pilau masala without clove. Yes, indeed. And the green ones, those are the young flowers, but the more the flower grows, it becomes red. So, easy yeah. zenya is a red zimekoma. Ndiyo zimekoma. And then zina kaushwa. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Mm. So, these clove trees were brought in 1818 by the Sultan of Zanzibar. This is how the tree looks like, the clove tree. You can get oil from the cloves which can be used as a healing healing oil for a toothache all these are clove trees all of these tall over green wow mm. we call wow. a rain tree rain tree yeah wow Is lemongrass. Mm. Mm. Cinnamon bark. This is the cinnamon bark. Pili pili kicha. Pili pili kicha. Yeah. No kicha. Uh, yeah. So these kicha peppers. Kicha. Yeah. Pili pili kicha. Very hot. In Zanzibar, ginger is used as Viagra for men, yeah. and they put it in tea, or in the food, or they use it dry. So how do they use it as an so they are Viagra? Just they just eat and yeah, put it in others tea. Others like to chew like this mm -hmm. when they're fresh, mm -hmm. and others after dried, they are going to mix as a tea. Mm. You oh. see, or in a soap, mm -hmm. they just apply in ginger. And always cardamom, it has a lot of fruits. Mm -hmm. You see, but it categorized in two parts. Mm -hmm. There is the main and the minor roots. Okay. But main roots going direct under the ground mm -hmm. to search some water is to make a cardamom plant itself to survive. Mm -hmm. And the others miners are coming outside and lying on the safe on the earth surface like this you see, mm. whereby that's nice or that's special for producing some fruits. Mm. See, yeah. 
I have typophobia, so I hate seeing holes like this. Lakini this is a dry jackfruit with termites. Kona mchwa. Mhm. Yeah. Oh, the lakin. Wow. <laughs> wow, Asante Sana. That was so interesting. <laughs> like, that's the only way to get a coconut. How do you like it? Mama, you've not even it's taken it. Like it. It's like the one we took yesterday. Mm -hmm. wow. Thank you so much. So, umekuwa ukipanda mti kwa mdamu gani? Mara nyingi wanapokuja kama nyingi. Aha. Oh. from the wine and food review and we're in Zanzibar so I already have some cassava necklace and another turtle necklace a ring a watch and also a flower crown let me grab my flower crown and also my flower crown so now today we've done the spice tour it's just the best thing in the world I've been looking forward to do this spice tour I've been reading it reading about it in blogs in books in video I've been watching it in videos and today I did it. So what happens is we go through, the, we go to the farm. Actually, we've done a lot of walking today. We've been looking at different parts of plants uh, and the different parts of a plant that are used to make spices. For example, the leaf, the bark, the flowers. For example, in cloves, they use the flowers and in the cinnamon, they use the bark and also the shoots. So it's been an eye-opening experience. So most of us, sometimes you take a spice from the supermarket not knowing what exactly this spice entails or how it is made. I actually didn't know how cardamom looks like. I didn't know how curry looks like. But today I've been able to see them. So come and follow me as I show you some of the spices. So for example, this is ginger coffee. So we've also learned how to make it. And this is the spice market where you can get banana coffee. We have cinnamon coffee, we have ginger coffee, we have banana coffee. Also here we have lemongrass coffee with vanilla. Wow. And here we have tea, like banana tea, cinnamon tea, cardamom tea, this is a ginger tea, this is a lemongrass tea, and here we have peppermint tea. Also here we have ginger tea with, ba with banana, we have Zanzibar spice tea and a powder spice tea. Also here garam masala, and here we have five spice. You know masala? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, masala is mixer. Also we have tea masala. So this is the best tea people from Zanzibar like so much to drink. Mm -hmm. And here we have hot curry and here we have pilau masala. Do you know pilau? Mm. Yeah. And here we have chicken masala, we have biryani masala and tandoori masala. Also we have fish masala, we have curry powder, red curry and ginger powder. And here we have cayenne pepper. Do you know cayenne pepper? Yeah. Mm. And here we have cayenne pepper powder and this turmeric. Also we have coriander powder, we have cinnamon powder and cumin powder, we have hot chili.
and I'm going home with a handbag, a flower crown, a neck piece, actually two neck pieces, and this, and this. So yeah, it's been worth it. I have a whole jewelry set. Tess, what do you have to say about the space tour? What have you learned a lot? Yeah, I've learned a lot. Mm -hmm. Vanilla, you kept talking about vanilla. And until next time, bye. Thanks for watching my vlog. <laughs> my flower crown. Okay, bye. Bye.